Temporary housing is arriving in eastern Kentucky, and even more help is on the way. Governor Andy Bashir joined local leaders in Perry and Floyd counties as some of the first travel trailers arrived in the community. Bodie Brooks reports. We're going to be here every single month and every single year it takes to rebuild. More than a month since the flood struck eastern Kentucky, signs of recovery as 41 new trailers arrived, giving a stable place to stay. We have hundreds of people on the waiting list for temporary housing, many of whom are sleeping at tents, vehicles, damaged homes with mold rapidly growing along the walls. Dennis Gross is one of those flood victims with tents up outside his home. They was given to us by our church and stuff. It ain't home, but it'll do. He, like so many others, have been frustrated over a delay in direct aid. He hopes to get a trailer to shelter his mom. We was promised, promised this, promised that. Uh, I'm a veteran, and uh, I know how it goes. There's a lot of red tape anytime you do anything when you fool with the government. So I figured it'd be a month or two. I didn't know it was going to be like this. The space is limited with over 900 families currently applied. After a generous gift from Louisiana, as many as 300 trailers will soon be set up across eastern Kentucky. Governor Bashir says there's no limit as to how long families may stay in these trailers. Teams will be checking in from month to month in hopes of finding better options. But the governor says many families may stay in these trailers for as long as a year. This is not the long-term solution. 20 years from now, we don't want to see Eastern Kentucky residents living in them. But as the region recovers, Hazard Senator Brandon Smith knows there is a concern some flood victims won't come back and is promising continued support to avoid an exodus from Eastern Kentucky. I don't want my district to be the trailer park capital of the world. I think people deserve better than that. A lot of people lost beautiful homes and I want them to know this is just a segue to get you back to that beautiful home. In Hazard, Bodie Brooks, Fox 56 News.